Hello there! This is Melek and welcome to episode 15 of my Let's Play Dwarf Fortress. Um, we're, we're doing alright, we're doing alright. Um, I figured out why I couldn't, because if you go to the smelter and I'm like, um, oh, why can't I make coke from coal? Oh, it won't let me. Um, and the reason why is because I have absolutely no charcoal. So what I'm actually going to have to do is start off no, not there. And start off, make some charcoal. Make sure I've got a couple of charcoaly people. I've got a lot of recruity people. In fact, actually, we've got lots of tanners. Uh, I need to rename people as well. We've got tanners who are actually tanning. Cool. Right. Canis Rain. Actually, no. We've got all these peasants. Let's um, let's give some of you peasants a, a profession. That that would be the that would be the kind thing to do, wouldn't it? So let's zoom in. Paragon Fishhead 2. You're currently boozing away. But you're about to get a career. And that career is... Um... Would it be metal smithing? Furnace operating? No, it's something wood... Re um, no, it's not wood. Crafts? Crafts? Wood crafting? Oh, hang on. There's quite a lot of weird stuff in here but it's not not quite right other jobs no farm oh is it like a weird one that's in here we go wood burning potash making yeah yeah you you can do all, all you can do wood burning and furnace operating um and because you are doing that now I'm also going to rename you a little, just because I can. Trainee Burner. <laughs> you burn stuff. Okay. Actually looking quite good, that arrowy thing. Although it doesn't look like there's anybody training. Oh, that was the other thing I needed to do. Now is that charcoal actually going to... I'm going to charcoal it up. In fact, actually, now you've gone to sleep, so basically you've gotten drunk and full unconscious. Great, okay. Um, <laughs> X-Way, you, you are now also going to um, become a Bernie person. So I'm going to give you... Um, yeah, I'm going to give you good old furnace operating. But I'm also then going to give you wood burning as well. View you, customize you, Janie, burner. Because then you're kind of smelters, slope, stroke, burny people. Oh, we've got some merchants. Quick, let's get some merchants and stuff. Sort by distance, no, sort by value. Marble mechanisms, they are good, marble mechanisms are. Damn, they are good. We've got quite a lot of marble mechanisms and floodgates and the like. So, yeah, I'm definitely gonna. And a marble coffin, cabinets. Okay, right, everyone do that. And oh, it looks like we've got charcoal being made. Who got there? X way. Well, of course, yeah, you were not busy. Now, the military. Military, military, military. I need to give you breaks, and I also need to. Um, so the Golden Infernos are the. Mark's Dwarves, but we're, if we look at equipment, the Golden Infernos, what, really, Tin Domains, here we go, there you go, you, you're, the Tin Domains are, um, for whatever reason, <laughs> are the ones that uh, are going to have the ranged weapons. The gold Infernos are the ones that are going to have all the metal stuff. Yeah, that'll do. Um, but the other thing as well is I need to change your schedule so that you're not constantly training. Because I don't think it's a good idea Give 
give order, cancel order, copy orders, paste orders, tab order list. Um, doesn't seem to be any obvious way of... No. See, they're training too much, and, and people are... Shift and tab. Oh god, no. That's not right. Give order. So, I, do I have to sort of give the order now? Edit the order. Here we go. So, if I edit the order... Oh, here we go. But it's still training. Civilian clothes or not. Cancel order? Oh, here we go. Let's give you breaks, shall we? Give order. I'm just trying to... See, that was cancel order. Now, if I give an order... Move selector, not defend burrows. Train. Oh god, this is so complicated. There we go. What I'm trying to do is give each of them a break from the rigorous training schedule that I've previously given. There you go. But they're alternating. So that should hopefully keep our military military good. So I assume no scheduled order means that they are then There we go. So that so they're in civilian clothes with no orders for a good lot for you know three months in each year they um, they will then do that that that's good is it not probably okay tin domains ammunition also the hunters are allowed bolts <laughs> the uh, the tin domains are not Okay, so I need to assign ammunition to the tin domains. Bolts. Question is... Okay, material. Oh, here we go. Bone. Bone bolts. Use for... Training. That's combat. No. Okay, so then we need to add another item, bolts, material, um, metal, not in training. So I'm now telling the tin domains to, to use in training bone bolts and in combat metal bolts. The hunters have got shed loads of, of bolts anyway. Um, but I want them to be metal bolts, so the hunters don't use bone bolts, because they're for training. I, I think I've kind of done that. There we go. We have a series of um, military p dwarves who have now not been military dwarves anymore. Okay, that, that charcoal is sorted. Here we go. You see, now things have gone white again. And there we go. Make shed loads of coke. Just, just keep the coke coming. So we've got a load of people who have uh, who are now a bit happier. Okay. Now we have two wells. I wonder how happy people are in general. So make coke. 
Yeah. I suppose we want to smelt stuff as well. Like that. Billion bars. Sterling silver. And for now, I'm going to leave it at that. So hopefully now you'll cycle through, make coke, which I've heard you get loads of coke. Um, that can build up and up and up and up. Um, oh, we've got another, another... Right, we need to rename and trade and, and do all sorts of things. We need a trader at the depot. So I think I've kind of gotten bolts done. You know, all the ammo for, for various peeps. Yeah, I, I think so. Yeah, okay. I, I think I'm I'm kind of happy about that now. Right, let's trade. Go on, Gavin Chaos. Let's see what you can get. Wow, okay. We've got a lot of bars. We don't really need the bars at the moment, but steel bars, it's not going to hurt, is it? First things first. Let's look for stuff like wood, which is really cheap, and we can never have too much wood. We can just make endless, endless beds out of the stuff. And let's give them massive profit from that. Because that will make them happy, happy, happy. What now have we got? Tail fiber ropes. Ropes. We need to get someone actually weaving and making clothing. Because we've got that... All that stuff. Um... And all the threads and... Oh, we've got donkeys and, and drakes. I'm assuming that's not... A dragon, I'm assuming it's a duck. Okay, let's let's trade for the donkeys and, and things like that. And a peahen, a peacock. Oh, we could have peacocks. We could breed peacocks and a bull. Why not? Butcher that thing. For nom nom nom. Barrels. Barrels are always good. What the hell is that? Giant cave swallow blood barrel. <laughs> Gremlin blood barrel. <laughs> I still wonder. I mean, are they going to make black pudding or something? Which, admittedly, that would be awesome. Um, and more blood. Why? Why would you? Why would you want blood? I, I don't know. Okay, dwarven rum. We might as well have that. Mule blood. More various barrels. Various. Oh, we've got. No, we don't want that beer. Blood barrels. Blood barrels. You know what? I'm thinking. Why don't we get some of this, some of these blood barrels, and just see what? I don't know. Do are they going to actually then horse blood barrel? <laughs> Ridiculous. We've got. Uh, it's a liquid. What do you mean liquid barrel? What is it? An unidentifiable liquid barrel. Oh no, I've exited out. Oh, that was slightly foolish. Fine. Be like that. And there I was, building up my trade. Okay. I just grabbed pretty much every living animal barrel, uh, animal barrel, animal cage, and then rum and, and random empty barrels. I was also doing that as well. So, rum, beer, miscellaneous liquid, dwarven ale, more blood. Why not? Let's just grab some blood. It might be useful for something. I've no idea what, but it might be. You can't... Dwarven syrup? That's pretty pricey. Okay, let's... Uh... Alright, look at that. Masterpiece marble mechanisms. 720, that is ridiculous. Oh, for goodness sakes. Stop being... Ridiculous profit. You can't possibly be expected to have that much profit. Okay, we've got a lot of buckets. Liquid barrels. It's the unidentified liquid barrel. Why not? We'll grab it. 
there any bins though? Hmm. Whatever. Yeah, let's grab it. Okay. Various training stuff. A copper pick. Well, it's not gonna hurt, is it? Copper crossbow. We can make our own crossbows, but it's going cheap. Bronze crossbow, why not? Saves us having to faff about, doesn't it? I'm not going to bother with a steel crossbow. There's copper short swords, steel warhammer. You know what? That would be good. Another copper pick, not going to hurt. Groundhog leather cloak. Various cloaks and dresses and see that's a dress it's quite expensive, isn't it? Say so it's not of any specific quality. It's just a normal kind of thing. We're gonna make lots and lots of armor soon. Copper shield, that'll do. Just spotting things, you know, a little picking them up. Why not, Copper Helm? It's not gonna hurt, is it? <laughs> gloves. Various gloves. Da -da -da. Various chest. Some sand in bags for whatever reason. Dimple dights. Pricey. There's a lot of it in there, though. That's the thing. Ostrich leather. Sweet pod. We've got plenty of sweet pod, I believe. What else have we got? Various other... We've got cat leather and... Do 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 here we go. We've got cloth. Yes, I know I've got loads of cloth already, but to be honest, it's not gonna hurt to have a little bit of cloth. Just a few more bits of cloth. Leather bin. We want leathers. We've got skunk leather and cougar leather and oh my goodness, goose leather. How does that even work? Giant wren leather. <laughs> Reindeer leather. Nice. More leather. Keep mole dog leather. Okay. Iron bolts. We don't really need... We can make a lot of bolts at the moment. Um, ostrich bone bracelets, steel bolts, bronze bolts. We can make bolts, we can make bolts, it's not going to be a problem. Lots of anvils. Why is that steel anvil so cheap? Or is that just somehow it's not displaying correctly? Ah, here we go. <laughs> lots and lots of vile food. What oh, I love buying massive amounts of nasty food. Because we can just cook it and make massive supplies. I mean, we produce our own food, but not bloody much. And to be honest, who cares? I mean, we've got so much stuff going on. So various threads and yarn... Giant hamster leather trousers. Hamster leather. How many hamst giant hamster? Well, that's okay. I was about to say how many hamsters does it take to make a pair of leggings, but I'm guessing if it's a giant hamster, then that would that'd be quite scary, actually. Um, ostrich leather backpack. We'll have that. Another backpack. Backpack. 
Again, these are all good. These are all good things. Giant sparrow leather quiver. The mole leather quiver. Yeah, they're a bit pricey, but again, it's it's worth worth grabbing. I still don't know why the trap components don't work. Still haven't managed to figure it out. Pig cheese, goat cheese, llama cheese. There's a lot of cheese. That's a lot of cheese. Okay, should I actually trade now? Because it might you might find that it's a bit tricky to get up to that level of... No, we don't find it tricky to get up to that level of value at all. Oh, we've only barely got a profit there. They're not gonna. They're not gonna go for that. Okay, let's have a look at the pricey things that I've added to the to the mix. We want all the food. We can go without cloth. We can go without a bit of leather as well. Trade. Okay. He seems pleased. Oh, he's still not going for it. He's still pleased though. Oh, he's not happy now. Come on, give me a break. Oh, he's very happy about the trading. Same, we haven't got anything left to trade now. But that's acceptable. <laughs> we uh, we we're, we're doing all right. I I think that we're uh, sorted. I feel like I'm getting getting stuff done. You know, getting stuff done. Now what we could really do with is splitting out some of the stockpiles. Oh, winter. Okay. Okay, now I need to finish this bit, which is a bit of a pain. Oh, chairs. We could do with a lot of chairs, couldn't we? We've got a lot of marble thrones. Let's um Okay, why have I put a floodgate there? It's mental. Let's just chuck everything in there. Get rid of that. Build chair. Boom. Everyone's going to go mental now and, 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 and equip all that stuff. That looks good. Everyone's putting the chairs in. Now we've got a lot more food, I think we probably could maybe do with a bit of buttering, a bit of brewing, and a bit of food preparation. We also need a nice food stockpile. Oh. Whatever. Unsuspend that. And with any luck. Oh, look at that. Everyone's swarming in there with the food. What I'm actually going to do is I'm going to change the settings on this food and make it. Um, Make it booze. Drink. There we go. We're gonna make it a drink stockpile. This one we're gonna make the food the, the, the non-drink stockpile. And then we're gonna have a rough idea at a glance anyway. Um what's what? So now they're probably gonna move a load of the food back out of that bottom stockpile. Wow, that that's um that's a lot of stuff that's been moved over here. There's a lot of dwarves drinking away. There's a lot of stuff being moved. Damn. There's a lot of stuff being moved. Uh, 
How's the... Oh! Wow! The amount of water we've got in the tank is, is quite low. In fact, there's the top level there is empty. Although it looks like the next level down has got stuff in it. That's actually just us seeing the next level. So the top two levels are empty. The level below that is half full. So actually the tank is only half full now. It's approximately half full. Should be fine. Should be fine. And it'll fill up come spring. Now I'm just trying to think how best to do that actually. Actually, yeah, we need to dig more. We need to get this moat sorted out. Um we could put up stairway there and a downward stairway there. I don't think that's quite Nice wide corridor. When when uh, everything melts, then we can uh, actually. Then again, the downward stairway there. Dig that away. Upward stairway there. Get rid of that because we can then. Yeah, I've I've got a plan. I've got my plan. Like that, da, 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 da. like that. 